Hello, my name is Carl. I'm with Prices Alarms Tech Support, and today we're going to walk through upgrading firmware in Angel Logics Recorder. Now, we're assuming that you've already followed the instructions and gone on to our website and downloaded the firmware for your particular NVR or network video recorder and have placed it then on a flash drive or USB drive. It's not a very big file, uh, so even a small flash drive should be able to take the file in place of it. Make sure you have it on one of these. Now we're going to go right to it here, and you're going to plug it into the front of the uh, recorder. And in this case, it's in the bottom left side here, so we're going to just plug that in. And we're now going to go to the screen here. We're going to log in, uh, or, if you're, or if it's already logged in, you can just click right into the menu itself. And on the menu toolbar, we're going to select device management, or in your case, it might be called system settings. You click on that. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Upgrade Firmware. From Upgrade Firmware, it's going to show you the file that's on the flash drive that we plugged into the front of the recorder. We're going to select that file here, and we're now going to select Upgrade. The uh, system will upgrade as soon as you hit the Yes, and now we're just going to wait for it to finish its upgrading, which can take it a few minutes to do that. Now once the upgrade has been completed, uh, the recorder may automatically restart itself. Uh, this one did. In cases where the recorder simply completes the process of the upgrade, uh, you'll then have to manually restart the recorder. And to do that, we're going to select the power icon here on the far right, and then you're going to select reboot. You'll have to enter in your admin password, and then uh, select OK and the system will ask you to confirm that you want to restart the system. Go ahead and click yes and the system will now restart. And once it's restarted, the complete op upgrade process will have been completed. Okay. Now that the system's restarted itself, that concludes our upgrade for today. If you have any further questions or need some further assistance with the upgrade process, just give us a call here at the office and we'll happily walk you through that. Thanks very much for taking your time to watch this video. You have a great day. Thank you.